Hello, boys and girls, and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included here on our frosty rhyme planet in the Rocky Laboratory. Last time we have seen that even building the auto sweeper out of steel is not uh, heat resistant enough because in here that's one of the few places where it's a bit on the warmer side uh, most of the rest is somewhat cool i see uh here uh, this basin is is heating uh, everything up here in the base we also get a bit more uh, temperature so uh what i decided at the end of our last episode is that we will create a vacuum and uh, to have a vacuum we need to have a way uh, to separate the gases inside from outside so we cannot use a gas lock so we have to find a liquid that will work uh, but will not freeze in temperatures uh, uh, down to minus 50, I would say. So, let's create the lock here. Um, this um, we will need to dig this out and when thinking of liquids that we might be able to use uh, I am thinking of crude oil minus minus 40 maybe that will work um, another option of course would be uh, petroleum um, that is a bit lower but that's also a bit more difficult to to get our hands on because down here we do have a, a leaky fissure and up until now I have not been interested in but maybe it might have its uses and then of course here we will need a, a bottle emptier and a ladder down on the uh, outside and if we have this in place and the lock we can actually close uh, this one, this door, so uh, access only through this side. However, I am curious uh, if we have a vacuum in here and the gold comes out liquid does it solidify i'm i'm not sure so maybe uh we uh, need to to have some some cooling system uh, installed after all
We will we will figure that out as as we go along. Not much has happened up here, but I did prioritize the work down here a bit because we uh, need the uh, the crude oil before we can uh, uh, actually do anything in here. But last time or the episode before we added a second uh, farm so now we have sufficient uh, food to add another duplicant and let's see we want probably someone uh, who's good at doctoring uh, which all have but here periodically falls asleep that's not good with the low amount of duplicants that we have and machine we decrease that uh, don't like that and okay doctoring but decreased medicine that's a contradiction on itself so uh, pay actually looks pretty a pretty good caregiver increased medicine on top of that night owl um, and germ resistance decreased but as this is a, a, a cold planet we actually do not have any germs i think at least not from from slime just uh, from everything else um, so let's see there you are you will go down the road of medicine first and then we will see and we will see now this side is also finished and uh, I already uh, queued up the uh, uh, crude oil And next, what we need to do is have a pumping set up. So down here we have a bit of crude oil. It's it's not much. Um, let's see temperatures. Down here we are pretty good. Um, so we should be able to place a, a normal... Let's not make that out of iron ore, because iron ore we need for our uh, steel pipeline. Let's make it out of aluminium ore. Bad out from this volcano. So that's up the priority on this one and on this one. I'm not really interested in uh, the stats of uh, of this fissure. Um, because we just have to, to take what we get there and eventually I would hope that we have uh, some more oil down below. Okay, the temperatures here are in the in the positive that should be good because that means that our crude oil does not not freeze but the temperatures are in the positive because they come out here from from 
this side. So I'm not entirely sure what happens if uh, we uh, manage to get the vacuum in here. Then we will no longer have any heat transfer. So uh, let's call this yet another experiment. We have a bit of crude oil here and our pump system is also complete so let's lock this door and then we can see how we fare with our experiment. We also have something in here and by the looks of it uh, both of these are, are pretty decent but a decreased athletics uh, I'm not so keen on but not being able to do doctoring not to worry we have a doctor um, shabby dresser yes well uh, we will give you a nice suit to contract that and uh, not everyone needs to uh, research so we will take Turner However, we have one bad uh, to few, so let's actually uh, dig out a bit here on this side uh, and make this just another room. Um, ooh! Can I now choose the painting? Oh. And with the schedule, now we have three on this one and three on that one with pay getting uh, night attributes. Uh, which is a nice uh, side effect. So, how are we doing up here? So, basically important thing here is that we have a bit of liquid here. So, no gas can pass from here to there. Uh, because uh, liquids and gases cannot... Uh, 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 occupy the same tile. So either we have a liquid here or we have a gas. So we are getting close to the vacuum in here and also the temperatures are now around the 100 mark. So we can actually see uh, that. Let's, let's repair that one. And unfortunately our gold volcano is now dormant so we will not know if this works out within the next 55 cycles um, what we also can do is uh, go around and um, add a few more batteries uh, because maybe we cannot store infinite amount of natural gas, so maybe uh, a store a bit more in energy in, in batteries might work out best. And then we have another thing in here. Uh, no. Um, on a whole, yes, but decorating we do not need. So welcome to the uh, to the colony, Mima. Um, you will go down that line, and that occupies all our beds. Uh, we do have uh, a bit more uh, liquid leakages from up here where uh, the pipe constantly breaks. We 
because the water freezes but by the looks of it um, the water here is soon run out so that should put a stop to that problem looking at the temperatures the water down here that's warming up because we're pumping in water from here um, so we probably have to be careful not that it gets too warm because then that would uh, uh, prevent the, the growth of our crops because they are on the other side so it's a fine balance act between uh, providing enough heat for them and uh, um, not enough not too much heat so I think what we will do in the next episode is thinking about um, the uh, Uh, oxygen docks that we probably have not researched yet so let's let's see um, yes the Atmos uh checkpoint and docks so we can basically go outside without fearing uh, to suffocate once we have the the vacuum in here we can then turn off this this gas pump i don't think uh, we need to destroy it and um, in the next 50 after 55 cycles or 54 we will see if uh, this vacuum setup is an improvement over what we had so yeah I think uh, that's 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 this episode we will finish this uh, this uh, this vacuum before the last one but as you can see uh, now it's only a matter of, of time until uh, the last molecule of uh, uh, air is uh, pumped out. So hope you enjoyed this episode and join me next time when we will tackle a new project. Until then, goodbye.